let's get to work. Welcome to week three of, um, Talk. The official review show for the 2016 Miss Bio Work pageant. Sponsored by work.com. Now let's get to work. Yas. See me when you work, 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 work. Last week, our lovely bio babes brought us talent with no mixes. This week, the lovely ladies are bringing us talent. Anything's go! I am so excited. Literally, these girls last week brought the drama just with lip syncs alone. And this week, the ladies get to show us everything they got. Tricks, flips, whips, the whole tea. Bring it on, girls. <laughs> so, let me just tell you a little bit about myself. My name is Mercury Rising. I hail from Sacramento, California, and I've been doing drag for three years. I like to play with makeup. It's my favorite thing ever. By day, I work with a couture designer on my cosmetics line, and by night, I transform into the fabulous goddess that you see before you. Enough about me. Now let's introduce my close personal sister, the backflipping, split poppin', whirling dervish herself, <laughs> May Half a Man. <laughs> Hi y'all, it's nice to be here. I ain't that, you know, crazy, but something about me. My name is May Halfman. I mean, I'm, you know, I do splits. I do the, you know, the cha-cha, I do the, you know, the back of kind of stuff. May is literally the fishiest girl in town. The daytime fish of Sacramento. I gained a few weights, so. Without further ado, let's get to work. Kicking this week off is Miss Monroe Fitzgerald! Oh, Marilyn! Hello. Monroe Fitzgerald served us Broadway glamour. Straight up fabulousness. Could you believe she took off that shoe at the end and threw it? She dude, just threw it. Dude, it, it was, didn't fall off. It did not fall off his feet, but oh my god. She said, boop, no, like, take my shoe. Like she said, take my number. Boop. Wrote it on the shoe. Said, she wrote her number on the bottom of the rhinestoned sneaker. The rhinestone. And tossed it to him like, she said, take it. My number is 1-800-FUCK-ME-BITCH. <laughs> and me. threw it. <laughs> and oh my god, she just went from... Costume change to splits to something I would do. It was a play, it went from seven minutes of heaven. Monroe Fitzgerald, we give you two tongue pops. <laughs> something like that. <laughs> like that. Like Good that. job, girl. Next up, we have my sexy Gemini sister, Gypsy Gemini. If her face don't stay together, stay forever, stay forever. Girl, you ripped your face off. It was falling like fall leaves. <sighs> Just oh my god. <sighs> literally, literally, that was some dope shit. Oh my god, I can't believe it. Dope was... shit. Like you were injecting glitter dope into your lips. Your face? Plastic surgery tees. I can't. Girl, so your makeup was giving me Violet Tchotchke meets Bianca Del Rio, and then you wrapped it up with a little bit of pearl. Like, that's, I just had to give you a RuPaul Drag Race reference because that was how clean cut your video was. And you stole my outfit! That was my outfit. That was my outfit. Gypsy Gemini, you were serving sultry, seductive sexiness, and I'm giving you two tongue pops. I'll give you two tongue pops too. But I do want to ask though. Bring it back. Thank you. Up next, we have Miss Kitty Meringue. I'm super excited to have such a great audience here. Kitty Meringue was serving some stand up comedy. She was serving laughs unlimited. Delusion. Because you have to be full of delusion to not only think you can tell stand up comedy, uh, but to do it in front of a sheet hanging up in your dining room. She is the delusionist. <laughs> you know, 
I'm saying? Oh my god, your video made me so hungry. I have to have an appetizer sampler right now. Like, man, can we go get that? You know, with my appetizer. Let's go. Come on, come on, Kitty Marine, we're gonna give you two tongue pops. <laughs> Next, we have our conceptual queen, Miss. Pia Retta Victori! We've broken up. I don't know what it is with you girls this week, but you're making me hungry. Mm-hmm. And I eat a lot. And I poop a lot. Pia Retta Victori, your makeup is like in your face. Mm -hmm. it, your makeup is an in your face interface. I mean, I would love to enter her face. But oh my god, the makeup, the blue outfit. I love not. Okay, let's go. Fioretta Victory, you gave us color, you gave us concepts, and I'm giving you two tongue pops. I can't even do it anymore. Next, we have C -C -C Cream Victoria serving up Piggy Piggy, please put it in me, baby. Give me, give me more. Girl, I'm a pig for you. I just realized her costume was a pig. Took me a while. Yeah, no, her costume was a little. Until like, I saw her little piggy tail. She was like a burlesque piggy. Like, it was so adorable. She was definitely giving me, like, exotic fan dance. Smuggling fawns. Okay. I don't eat pork, but you're making me kind of hungry. We can make obsession. I wanna eat it, eat it, and then I'll grill it, grill it. I'm a pig for you. Put some pepper, sprinkle salt. Queen Victoria, you're making me hungry for you, baby, and I'm gonna give you. Two tongue pops for the bacon. Two tongue pop. Ooh. Girl, that was three tongue pops. Up, uh, up next we have Kasha Davis. Kasha Davis. <laughs> Maureen San Diego. Well, she looked like Kasha Davis in that purple outfit. I will give you looks. Um, I don't know how this is staying up right now. Um, girl. Oh my God. You knocked us out of our seats. <sighs> Your balls came off. You are so freaking hilarious. hilarious. I will never, ever look at the song Fireworks to Sing. Oh, oh, oh. She's a look girl. She's a look queen. Okay. She's a model queen. Okay. She doesn't do comedy. She doesn't do funny. She's all look, all real. And when you could buy a vagina and Michaels too, I'm going there. I uh, need one. Maureen San Diego. I'm still a man. Can I get your vagina at Michaels? <laughs> Maureen San Diego, I'm going to give you two tongue pops and then drop dead. I'm gonna give you two tongue pop too. <laughs> okay, you guys, we're getting close to the end, and bringing it in next is Miss Teeny Davenport. Phillips! <laughs> Teeny Davenport Phillips was giving me all types of Harley Quinn meets Rihanna meets S&M meets Joker and Eminem. Well, there was Joker in there. Like, she served multiple characters and I thought that was dope as shit. Like, who invited a drag queen? Oh my god. <laughs> Girl! A drag king! Like, she gave us bio queen, she gave us bio king, she gave us everything. Girl, I was living. I was too. I was like, I want the hammer that she had. The Harley Quinn. So when I go to my ex-boyfriend's house, I could just bust, you know, his car open with that hammer. <laughs> like... <laughs> <laughs> Teeny Davenport Phillips, we give you two tongue pops. Bringing it in for the finale, we have Miss Crimson Kitty! Meow. 
Crimson Kitty was serving some serious retro vibes in this silent film. If we were having technical difficulties, or if that was the intent, however, girl, you still delivered. I was living for your $250 wig. That I'm gonna steal. I'm just kidding. Girl, <laughs> no, like, we're gonna have to, we're really gonna have to find you and take your wig. Don't make me find you, That because... That was the Gilda <laughs> of Gildas. I'm like, okay! Crimson Kitty, you gave me retro vibes, and I'm giving you two tongue pops. And the wig I'm gonna steal. Alright you guys, that wraps it up for this week. I'm gonna go do a cross country road trip and commit some Grand Theft drag on you ladies, so watch your wigs. I'm right behind her. You can follow me on all social media at rise underscore merc. Follow me also on Instagram, maybe Pat. These ladies served us cray, they served us talent. They serve like hunger craves. <laughs> no, I mean hunger pains. <laughs> They obviously gave May hunger pains. <laughs> Stay tuned for next week's episode of Miss Bio Work. And don't forget to subscribe to work.com. Now let's get to work.